today's Corona Kitchen we have the real one and only Pasta Carbonara This is how it's done You need two egg yolks And then you need Parmesan cheese and here mix it with the egg yolks and then mix it together and then a little bit black pepper You can also put the black pepper in the end on top of the pasta if you want. Yes, there is the sauce. And then you can start boil your spaghetti. I like this tall tallarin, tallarin. This is flat spaghetti. and put some salt in the pasta water. Any salt you like. The water should be as salty as the Mediterranean Sea. The salt is actually very important when boiling spaghetti. You really need quite salty water so that the spaghetti gets good taste. And now you can you can leave the spaghetti a little bit al dente and then you start frying the bacon. And then when your bacon is fried very crispy, you want it to be crispy, you add pasta there. You mix it with the bacon. And don't take any of the oil, the, the fat which is here, don't take anything out. Leave it there. Just add pasta. It already smells so good, so good. At this point you have to add a little bit this pasta water here. At this point you can use a little bit heat, but before you add the eggs you have to take the heat off. You want quite much water there. Then you just little little while you turn it around, mix it well. There you, little bit, you have already the sauce. And now you turn the heat off. Let it little bit cool down. It can't be too hot, otherwise you will get scrambled eggs. And that's not what you want. And then we add this golden juice. Mix it well. I will add just a little bit more black pepper. And why don't we 
add just a little parsley just for the color. And there you have it. That's it, there is no cream. So now we try it. Ooh, of course, a little bit parmesan on top. I almost forgot the parmesan. There is never too much parmesan. It's just very good.